What's up, comic creators? To change your speed uh, in your CapCut mobile project, it's actually very easy to do. Um, this clip right here moves really, really slow, so I'm going to try and speed this up real quick. Um, and the way that I want to do that is I select the clip. Um, as you can see, it's pretty long. If I were to play it, it goes really, really slow. But select the clip, and then you click on Speed at the bottom in the bottom menu. Then you want to click Normal for what I'm about to do. Um, curve is like giving you options uh, to change it in specific ways, but normal. And then I'm going to use this bar here and I'm going to move it up, holding my finger on the ball there. I can move it up, and once you move it up or move it forward, it'll change the speed to make it faster. And so I think I'm going to do two times speed here. And then once I select it, I go ahead and click check mark. You don't need to mess with pitch or anything like that, um, but click the check mark on the bottom right hand corner. And then that actually uh, will take you back to the main project. And now my video is actually uh, sped up. And for me, that works for this particular video because it needed to be, uh, you know, needed to be faster. But if I click uh, speed again, uh, while I have the clip selected on the bottom left-hand corner, um, and then I click normal again, I can, you know, adjust it once again. If you're not happy with the speed, you can go back that way and you hold the bar down and you can, or pull the ball down and move it around. You can make it slower. Uh, you can bring it back to normal by making it hover over one times. That's the regular speed. You click the check mark, and uh, now I've got this the slower moving footage uh, right here, uh, the way that it was before. So that is a quick tutorial on the speed like that, um, and adjusting speed in a normal way. Now I wanted to show you one last thing with this video clip here. So if I click that clip and I click speed again, but I click curve. Um, then this opens up uh, different options you can do where the it speeds up or slows down the video at specific points. So if I click on montage or I click on hero, you can kind of see how uh, in the left hand side of your screen here, um, how it when it's zooming in on the sky, it changes the speed at certain parts uh, of the of the clip. And then I can actually click edit again. If I click it again and I can adjust the length of it, how fast it is, that kind of a thing. Uh, but I'm just kind of scrolling through here and showing you these different effects you can do. And then once you uh, select one, you can customize it. Um, and then you just click the check mark once you have one that you have uh, or that you want. So, but that's the basics of, of doing different things that you can do. So if you have like a hero shot or something, you can do that cool thing in videos where it's zooming in slow and it speeds up and then it slows back down again, those kinds of things with it. So it's very customizable, very nice. Um, if you guys have any questions, uh, let me know in the comments below. Um, please like and share, subscribe. All those things really help the channel, and I greatly appreciate it. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please take the time to like, comment, and subscribe, as it helps us to further please our YouTube overlords. Check out more links in the description for continued assistance on your CapCut projects. And please keep your arms and legs inside the craft until it comes to a complete stop. Be sure to mind your headspace and watch your step as you exit. Failure to comply may result in serious injury or death. We will see you next time, Comet Creators. End transmission.